A Laterno University professor is teaming up with NASA for an eclipse project. And as KLTV7's Jamie Boyum tells us, even though she did not apply until last December, not only was she accepted, she was also asked to be a team leader. Laterno Mechanical Engineering Professor Jolynn Gowing is on a mission for NASA and Citizen Kate. She signed up to be part of an eclipse study through a social media post. I didn't even think I would be, so it was, it was really kind of a surprise when I was chosen. She says there are no qualifications, and the chosen are deemed... Citizen scientists. There are seven on the team. A housewife, we've got um, a couple retired professors, we've got some public uh, school teachers from Kaufman ISD, and then there's me, and I'm just a lecturer here at Laterno. She says there are about 40 groups across the country who were sent equipment for the study. We're all on the totality line, and we record it when it goes across us so that we can, they can do some more research. Um, they're trying to study that inner corona that doesn't have a whole lot of research done on it yet. They will record from Miller Grove, about 60 miles northeast of Tyler. The equipment is in Kaufman, where they've been training to use it. We've been meeting we've met pretty much every other week, trying to learn how to set up the equipment and get it going. Um, it's very finicky as to you have to get it lined up exactly on True North. Really, it's pretty much a small camera with a really big lens connected to a computer. Obviously, they only have one chance to get it right, so they practice a lot. And the recordings... They're going to stitch it all together and make a video of the total eclipse as far as they can go from Texas all the way up to Maine. Ready or not, here it comes. But Professor Gowing and her team plan on being ready for the five minutes of night. Jamie Boyum, KLTV 7 News. And they've been sending in practice data and getting some feedback. We're told they don't have to send the equipment back, so it'll be available for public use.